and some Western New Yorkers answered the call to help people in that storm ravaged state. Reporter Ryan Abergast has more on volunteers from a local tree removal company packing up their Buffalo Strong spirit and taking it on the road. Those are Western New York chainsaws ripping through the destruction left behind by Hurricane Ida. You know, you see the stories of the people that the, the tree comes through their house and they're displaced, they don't have a home. Ben Kravitz is the owner of Kravitz Tree Service in Fredonia. And it was Ben and his four-man crew who were the boots on the ground, volunteering their time for the last two weeks in southern Louisiana. We work from dark to darker. So, I mean, we were pulling anywhere from, I think, a 15-hour day at the minimum up to 18-hour days. Helping remove these massive trees that crashed into homes during the storm and being there for those who need it most. You don't have to make thousands, tens of thousands of dollars off one tree. Do a whole bunch of trees, help a bunch of people out. Kravitz Tree Service completed about 30 jobs over the course of their two-week stay in New Orleans. What these guys did in two weeks worth of time, I mean, they would probably normally do in about maybe a month, month and a half up here. And even though it was tough to leave... It's almost like we have a second family down in Louisiana now. These men knew it was time to go. I mean, it, it was a lot of work. Uh, we're all going to come home. We're going to be beat, tired, covered in poison ivy, but the hearts are full, so that's what matters. Full hearts that brought the Buffalo Strong Spirit to the Big Easy. Ryan Arbogast, 7 Eyewitness News.